Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Toxics, and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. Last time, we became the true gods of this world and defeated the, em the Emperor, the Reaper. And in today's video, we are finally heading down to the bottom of Mementos, to the path of Sephiroth, to the true depths. So, upcoming is a cutscene, so I'm just going to stop talking. It's time for us to go open the final door and see what awaits beyond the world we know. Actually, while we're here, um, i probably going to be mad at me for this. Yay! And now, yay, I'm I'm alright with this team. This this is this is kind of the team for the rest of the game. I mean, I could put Makoto and whatnot on. I should put Makoto on. I don't have a nuke user and I have every other... Okay. I don't have Seth! Oh no! I don't have Seth anymore. Eh, whatever. <laughs> I mean, shit. Shit happens. Hey, so, uh, this shit here's the door to the depths, right? It should be. Why? What's wrong? I don't know. It looks just like all the other ones. I was thinking it's a little disappointing. Maybe we worked too hard to get down here or something. The lack of unforeseen circumstances is nothing to complain about. Let us continue. Right you are, Yusuke. Right you are. And now, the path of Iwalith. The hell is this? It's some big fossil looking thing. So this must be the treasure. Wait, look on the side. It's the train running down to Mementos. So this is where that crowd of people was trying to reach? People are walking in and out of there, so the other side of the wall must be... Wait, it's not a wall, but a giant door? Guess that means the treasure's not here. Come on, let's stay focused. Sure thing. But if you'd notice, the bones that were initially making up the path of Sephiroth... Are n that's... that's a sight. That's an uneasy sight. But the path that was leading up the path of Sephiroth is now more smooth and polished. Not polished. But now more defined. And this giant centipede like snake fossil that is the doorway. Is this thing seriously a door? How are we supposed to get past? It opened straight away. I bet that means the inner depths the Meta Nav was talking about before are right ahead. Hold on. The door only opens from this side. What do you mean? Well, I took a quick peek at the mechanism inside the door. And it looks like you can only open it from here. We can get in, but nothing can get out. It's as though whatever lies within has been locked away. Wait, so you're saying that the people going in there are choosing a life of imprisonment? I have never felt such eeriness before. We'll find out once we reach the depths. Come on, let's go. Well then. <laughs> the hell is this place? It's so creepy. So those strange pipes tunneling through mementos were originating from down here after all. You know, I have been considering this for some time. They remind me somewhat of veins. More importantly, what's up with the scenery? What kind of distortion is this? I mean, what does everyone think this world is? Calm down, Lady On. The treasure's definitely here. And what's important, and that's what's important now. And I can sense something else. A tremendous presence that's coming from much deeper within. But... I don't know what I want to find... I don't know that I want to find out what that may be. But we must harden our resolves. <coughs> Alright. Well, I mean... This is your last chance, right here, to actually, well, is it? Yeah, this is your last chance right here to actually get your twin confidant to rank 10. By this point, you're going to be at least level 60, so if you need money for it, it's not going to be the most costly thing. Worst case, you can proceed ahead, kill a bunch of shadows, get some money, come back here. You can come to this point, and I know it says you can't leave, but I'm pretty sure you can head back. Which is this, like... What was the point of saying that if you can head back? But, um, we're gonna head in. We're gonna summon a few personas really quickly. A few personas that I want. We're gonna get in one with Nuke, which I believe is Hecaton Kairos. 
Uh, we're gonna get one with Psy, we're gonna get one with Ice, and we're gonna get one called Seth. I like Seth. But we're gonna fuse, we're gonna summon, so I will see you guys right about now. Okay, now that we have fused, um... I'm actually gonna show them off right now, just because I think they are stupidly cool personas. We have Osei. We have our little semen lizard guy. We have Quetzalcoatl. I'm sure everyone knows what Quetzalcoatl is. It's a very common thing in real life. We have Thanatos Picaro, who is our curse user. We have King Frost, our ice user. We have Seth. Everyone loves Seth. And then we have literally Satan. Yeah, let's... He literally covers the menu. That's how big he is. In battle, he can't even fit his whole body onto the screen. It's stupid. He covers the menu. Literally Satan. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm actually not really going to be using this guy because he's a fire user. And he's not the strongest. I don't even. I prefer the base version over the picaresque version because this looks better. But um, pretty obviously a really cool persona right here. It's the crow. You got Itachi's crow, and then you have actually Satan. We're gonna be using the crow. I know it's stupid. We're gonna be using the crow. I'm gonna get rid of him when I run out of space in my inventory for personas. But for the time being, we also downloaded Scott. We downloaded. We got Scott high in here. My personal favorite. I've already said this. One of my personal favorites. Big titty goth girl, not really big titty, but goth girl nonetheless. Pogging off. We got a bunch of stats on her. Mukara Karn, Masu Kakuja, and Mataru Kakuja. And we kind of just pop off like that. So now, now that we have all that done, it's time to advance into the place, I guess, into the depths. Come on, man. Oh shit. There are a ton of them gathered here. It looks like they're all trying to get past that door. But why is it so crowded? Oh, it looks like the door is keeping them all out. We'll have to try and look for another way in. Well, instead of looking for another way in, what you can actually do is just open the door. I'm kidding. If if that worked, that'd be really funny. But uh, as you can see, you hoppity hippity hoppity hoppity. That looks. Wow, it's a long way down. I like that you can see the spiral though. The spiral is very nice. And you got a few jail cells that people seem to be trapped in, or that veins seem to be coming through. I mean. And then, oh god, but there's one right here, and there's no veins coming out of it. And now, we just hop into here, I guess, and make our way inside. Yeah. Ooh. Um. I'm getting a bad feeling from this place. I wonder why. The shadows up front were trying to get in here, right? What could it be? What could it be, man? Focus. I don't know, but there's some items here. So one of which will give you that little effect right there, and I think it's very cool. And you can't open the door from outside either. It's just a broken door. There's no way for it to be opened. People will try their hardest, but never be able to. There are bones everywhere here too. True. Kind of a... Uh, not a pleasant sight. That's kind of the same creature, but on a much closer and in-depth level. They seem to be surrounding this place, even. It's quite gross. Quite grotesque. Okay, time for some cutscenes. Hmm? What is this place? I'm so happy. Are those chains on them? Is this a prison? <sighs> Who's captured here? Technically speaking, I would say it's someone's shadow. They're saying something. Come on, don't be out there and come on in. Don't open the cells, okay? I have no intention of leaving this place. They feel safe being here? What are you saying? You're being kept in a prison. This reminds me of Kamoshida's castle. They're like the slaves we saw there. That's right. This place is the best in the end. In the depths within is a system that grants desires. A system that grants desires? Something like that exists? Here? It's no use. You can't reason with these people. They're truly distorted, just like the scenery here. 
you end up searching for stuff or being troubled because you're outside the prison. There are things you don't need to know to live on. He's right. Things like the details on the system, the locked quarantine cell. Quarantine? Who's locked in there? Supposedly a great and truly dangerous criminal. But who would want to check a place like that? Come now, we don't have to chat like this. Why not come inside? Huh? Mona? Uh... Huh. Why are you out and about? Where are your restraints? No oh, crap! Removing your restraints is not allowed. Outsiders must be eliminated. This is Melchizedek. We've seen him before over in Sai's, uh, Sai, in Okumura's palace guarding the final will piece. This persona is incredibly weak to wind skills, so we're gonna summon a Quetzalcoatl and just bop him in the face. Unfortunately, you can't capture this one either, but you can just kill it in all out attack. And get a sick little cutscene featuring the original four Phantom Beasts. Woo! And now you're dead. Sorry, friend. Known you how many years? Around six, five years, six years now, and now you're dead. It's a person I know in real life. That was careless of us. It should be no surprise that a prison has guards. A person I know in real life has a similar name, is what I meant to say. Wait a sec. This is everyone's palace, right? Not like Kamoshida's castle. Who's keeping these people here? Mona-chan? I remember now. I've seen this place before. Hold on, though. It wasn't open until we came here today. Sorry. It's just a sense I'm getting. Still. It feels like I'm really close to remembering something important. You know, coming in here was what you wanted from the beginning. We just gotta keep moving on. On top of that, I'm curious to know who the ruler of this place is. Yeah, you're right. Wait, what about these people? Leave them be. They'll be taken care of if we erase mementos. Hey, it's dangerous to keep standing around here. Let's get going. Alright, alright, alright. We're gonna move a little bit forward, get an ambush on, fight a few guards just for fun, and then continue on with the area. This should be... yeah, we know this guy. Um, he is... yep, okay. Technical, we get him, and we guaranteed get him in our party. But, now we can talk to him. Lend me your power. So that's your move. And I guess... okay, Shadow Diplomat, we take that. Dude, Shani, I have got this girl waiting for me. You know what I'm getting at, right? Yeah, I think you could let me go see my girl. What kind of girl is she? Well, you're still a bit young for me to tell you that. She's, you know, a discreet adult woman. You know, in the human world, I hear that when people come at each other, they call it fate. What kind of fate do you think there is in this meeting between me and you? I think fate has brought us together. Yeah. Ah, well, that's true and all, but maybe it ain't a good idea to talk about yeah. it. Well, okay, make me maybe make the most of this next time. Later. I'm leaving for today. You better remember this. Cool. Okay, let's move on. Well, let's move on then. I like I love the area. It's just so eerie, so okay. grotesque and disgusting. I can feel it. It's so well put together. Hey, there's a zipline. For a chest over there. Zippy zip. Get all this stuff and then head over to the first puzzle of this. Dungeon, I guess you can call it. What is this? Joker, try activating it. This is a colored light battle <gasps> puzzle. Yes. Hmm? Is it back to normal? What? Just, that's what it was, Dad. Hmm, there seems to be more to this prison, but right now this is a dead end for some reason. And this must be a security system. Will we be able to proceed if we disable it? Probably. I'll need you to look into it a little more, though. 
Do it again, Joker. It looks like it's touching. It looks like touching it turns it back off. So it can't be that dangerous, right? Sure, but before we do that, I want to go zippy zip. Oh, never mind. I can't zippy zip. Oh, wait, there's a person here. Work hard. Struggle. Just a faint glimpse of happiness. Is any of that really necessary? This world is already complete. There's nothing left to do. The hell? Is this some kind of prison cell too? What's that those blood vessel things? Oh, that noise. Oh, that noise. Oh, it's in my ear. Oh, baby, I'm beating up a sum. I did the... I positioned myself like that on accident, so I just said it and said... Weird. Really... Gross. And again. This puzzle is quite simple. It is a simple light puzzle. Basically, if it's lit up on yellow, you want to activate it so it lights up on blue. Uh, you want to make it so all of them are lit up to blue. And then you can get back to the panel. So look, now it's going to activate to blue. Whoa, oh, it's a different color. So the mm. color of a spot changes when you walk on top of it. Joker, try making the entire floor blue for now. D dude, do you have any idea what that's got to do? Are you sure it'll be safe? Come on, let's yeah, go. How can things start with the leap of faith? The decision is yours, Joker. Well, it's not too hard. If we activated the one, we can kind of just go around. And now that they're all lit up, the beacon lights up. The... the the system, I guess, lights up, not beacon. Mm -hmm. The device is radiating a vibrant pink light. Uh-huh, it's probably connected to the color of the floor somehow. Since we changed all the spots on the floor to blue, the device's color changed too. Joker, try touching it now. Will do. Even though only Joker's the one that matters. It'd be cool if you could, like, control different members of the Phantom Thieves for this and then move them around so they could have to go to different spots to open up and do different parts of the puzzle. But, uh, yeah, that's not it. The broken door saved today. Go fight them. Wow. I'm gonna fight you. I'm gonna fight you. I'm gonna kill you. What are you? Melchizedek. Magardine. Oh, that's gonna kill, isn't it, actually? Oh, it didn't. Nice. I'm gonna talk with the destructive. Uh, yeah, you can't talk to him. Can you talk to the other one? Answer me this one thing. All right, I suppose you chose wisely. There's something you must do, and it is not my murder. It is to become aware of the gaze of our Father, who watches over you with loving grace. Alright. I prefer a harsher stare. Austerity is a favorable trait, especially when directed toward the self. But your world in this world. Everything is a creation of our omnipotent Father. You who reside in the world of the Almighty. What is it that prolongs you so? There's someone I want to save. So you have seen that there is suffering even in the world of the Almighty? Passion sounds familiar. Ah, this time I spent has awakened me into the truth. I am not a shadow of this place. I have resided with the sea of the human soul since ancient times. My name is Melchizedek. That is your name as well. Do not forget this. He's a fucking Power Ranger, man. And I love him. <laughs> I actually really like his persona. And not just because I'm biased, because a friend of mine has a similar name. I just will think it's cool. <laughs> okay. Now that we did that, we are going to continue onward. Ah, more blood vessels, huh? I'm going to just grab and dab. Grab and dab? Yeah, that's what I said. Doesn't matter if there's a red alert in the velvet room. We can't really do anything about that. Grab and dab yet again. That's another Melchizedek. Is this where I talk to you from? It is. There is nothing we can do. Parents. Teachers. All adults just manipulate us. Nobody listens if we try to oppose them. All that happens is our spirits are crushed. It might be smarter to just accept life for what it is. And surrender to their will. I... This is just like how I used to be. If I had stayed like that, I would sound just like her now. I didn't even realize that was a girl. Oh, there's not one over here. I thought there was. Broken handcuffs? Ooh. What's this over here? Oh, this is the dab. This is the dab. This is the zippy zip. Oh, where's the zip from? Oh, the zip's on the other side. Something. There's a person. I want to talk to the person. Hey, it doesn't matter if something is right or wrong. If there's a rule, we just have to follow it. If anything, those who treat the rules with honor are just. All those who break them are the villains. 
You talk about justice, but you know there's something stuck. There's something sucking stuff out of your head, right? That's kind of hot. Not gonna lie. Dad passed you, and we're gonna run the other way because that is the way we want to go. But there's a person over here, and there's a treasure chest, and a zippy zip. Such a foolish group. Your actions will change nothing. All of this is going to end soon, anyways. You might as well patiently await your demise. Huh? It's all going to end. What is he saying? It means that it's going to end. What else can I fucking mean when I say it's going to end? The world, you stupid bitch. What are you dumb? Go zipline. I will gladly zipline anyways. I was gonna do it anyways. Ooh. Alright, let's see what it is. Let's go check out Morgana. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, wait. Uh, fuck. Uh, uh, shit. Um, uh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I'm, uh, everything is falling apart. I don't know what to do anymore. Everything's falling apart. Ah, run through the doorway. Ooh, now we jump. Oh, you can't just jump off on the edge. Hey, there's a person. And some treasure over there? Can I jump down? Fuck. It's a shadow. No, that's just a person. Hey, why are you guys on that side? You really think you'll gain anything over there? You must be idiots, huh? Maybe you should be smarter about how you're living your life. But... Happiness is much more than simply gaining things. To be honest, I can't believe he's actually enjoying his life here. <sighs> Shadow! Enemy Show me your true oh, form. the camera fucked up and I was confused. Items! Open you? Open you? No actual treasure! <laughs> Never mind, I was gonna say, no actual treasure demon here, as far as I'm aware. Hope Diamond. I've not met this treasure demon before. Ooh, that was cool. My name is Hope Diamond. My existence shall become a new part of you. Maybe it isn't a new one. It's just one that I'm not familiar with. Um, Asterius, like I said, we're going to get rid of you because we don't actually need the devil on our side because I'm already the devil. Although he does have Titano Machio, which is probably one of the strongest moves in the game. Alright, gonna dab on another guard yet again. We're gonna get Melchizedek. Nice! Wow, he gets a skill. I totally care. Yeah, he's a... I should have explained he is a Hamon user, but then again, I don't explain what most personas do. Follow me those stairs of Dolly with a correct way of living. What well, is there to be confused about? Anyone who can't do that is just an outcast. All you really have to do is a better Ross. Hmm, how pathetic. He should be more aware of his own situation. True? Uh, oh my god, big burps. This one, honestly, pretty easy. Is this the same kind of thing as earlier? It should be, for the most part. Give it a try, Joker. Will do. From what I remember, this one is just down, up. I don't actually remember this one. Uh, uh, oh fuck, I pressed the button. Okay, we're gonna activate it again, and we're gonna do it. And we're gonna win. We're gonna be gamers, we're gonna win. We're gonna move all the way down to the bottom. That's gonna deactivate it, activate these two. Now we go here. This, 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 this. Wow. Down, 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 up, down, up, up, right, up, left, up, seven. Now we can just move our way on to the next part. Get a leather item, get a leather, get another item. See another man, Dems? In the long term, your struggles. Is that a woman model, though? That's a guy, that's a young man. In the long term, your struggles will transform into nourishment. All you need to do is endure. Or no matter how much they beat or kick you, it's all for your own self benefit in the end. If anything, I should feel thankful. This is exactly what I deserve. <sighs> it hurts just hearing this. I had the exact same mindset in the past. Yeah, there's a lot of people in the world who believe shit like that. And all I can say is get your fucking head out of your ass. That's what I believe, honestly. I believe a lot of people just need to get their head out of their ass. And stop giving a shit about things they don't need to give a shit about. And just live their fucking lives, man. We're all gamers for a reason. There's a safe room right here. I'm gonna dab on you. 
And I'm going to leave that safe room because we don't actually need it. It's just a safe room, but this area is pretty straightforward. This is the third and final light puzzle of this video. So let's do that. All right, activate this one, this one. Also very simple. They're, they're generally not difficult. We're going to go down, right, left, right, down, down, up, left, down, down, up, right, left, up. And boom. Pretty easy. We get to see the void below us because the game hasn't rendered in what's supposed to be below us for some reason. Or there just isn't anything there. And now we open our door. And right about now is where I'm going to say thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you all enjoyed. Next time on Persona 5 Royal. Wow, this place is ugly. It's just that bug thing again. Hate it. Next time. Oh, it's more than one. Ew, ew. That's so gross. Oh, that's so gross. I wonder if that's the Almighty that they were talking about, or maybe they just meant humans. Melchizedek. Weird Persona. Next time on Persona 5 Royal, we are heading further in towards the depths of Mementos. So until next time, I will see you all then. Goodbye, everyone.